Disneyland isn't just the happiest place on earth, but it's also one of the most photographed. The Disney parks regularly tops lists of the most Instagram places in the world. So if you are heading to Tokyo Disneyland soon and you can't wait to fill up your Instagram feed with those colorful pictures, then watch until the end as I list the photogenic and fun photo spots inside the park. You can't leave Disneyland without having a photo of this iconic castle. Due to the popularity of this Disney symbol, it sure can be crowded. So, I made sure to go here first thing right after I enter the park and here's what I got. The new Fantasyland is a perfect place to wear your Belle-inspired OOTD and take lots of photos posing as Belle. It was a bit of a challenge as the place was too crowded, but I really enjoyed this latest addition to the park, especially because I love Belle and this place was really full of Instagram-worthy photo spots. Since this is the newest area, many people visit and stay here, so if you're too shy to pose in the crowds, then I also suggest going to the next one on the list. This is located just beside the Beauty and the Beast castle. This theater is where they have the show, Mickey's Magical Music World, which you can only watch if you win the lottery through their app. But don't go inside the theater just yet. Go to the left part of the entrance area and enjoy a little photo shoot. If you want to have both an adventure and nice spots for the gram, then hop on that log raft and enjoy being on this Tom Sawyer Island in the middle of the rivers of America. There are many interesting spots like Huckleberry Swamp, the tree house, the suspension bridge, and a lot more. This riverboat ride around Rivers of America provides plenty of photographic potential. As the background continuously changes, you'll have ample opportunities for different shots. Toontown is extremely popular for Instagram shots simply because there are so many cute and colorful things all around. They also have funny spots just like these unliftable dumbbells. I really love taking photos in front of the castle, but I did have fun inside as well. In the fairy tale hall, you can put yourself in Cinderella's shoes, I mean glass slippers, and feel like a princess inside the castle. The outside of It's a Small World definitely screams Disney. It's so colorful and you probably don't want to miss taking a photo here.
Seasonal decorations at Disneyland are so adorable. They have yearly events like Easter and Halloween, but I usually go in December so I enjoy the Christmas trees and ornaments. Running out of poses? Holding Disney character shaped snacks will definitely level up your photos in the park. I made a video of the cute, cheap, and yummy food you can try at Tokyo Disneyland, so make sure to watch that as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this compilation of Tokyo Disneyland photo spots. If you know other spots that I didn't mention, let me know in the comments below. Make sure to watch my other Disney related videos too, and if you found them helpful, give it a like and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching until the end, and I'll see you guys again soon. Jane! A trip to any theme park is not complete without eating yummy snacks and meals. However, some of the food here can be undersized, overpriced, and underwhelming. But since you're already here, you might as well try the cute character shaped snacks, right? Besides, food plays an important part of your day while you're bouncing from attraction to attraction. So here's a quick list of the food you can try at Tokyo Disneyland.